Hey, it's Rick here and check this out. If you guys like aluminum back cases, but you don't wanna mess with the reception of your iPhone, this is one that's gonna fit the bill for you. This is by Solaris. It's called the Fender case. They've got it for the iPhone 4 and 4S, but I'm showing it to you on the iPhone 5S today. It'll also fit your 5 as well. The MSRP on this one comes in right around $34.95, but you can certainly do your shopping to pick it up a little bit cheaper if you'd like. I'll link in the description of the video as to where you can pick it up. And here is the packing that it comes in. Uh, as I mentioned, this is a aluminum back case, but it's also a snap-on shell, so it's not going to give you coverage down here or up above here. Let's talk about weight for just a moment. I'm going to power up the scale. We're at zero grams, popping this on the scale. We're coming in at about 22, 23 grams, so that's what we're talking about here. Weighs a little bit more than some of the other snap-on back shells back there, or out there, but that's because you've got some aluminum backing here. Here's the inside of the case. It's a very smooth, high gloss kind of hard plastic material. We're gonna get those buttons and we're gonna line those up first. And then you're simply gonna pop this side directly into place. And always with these snap-on back shells, especially if they have a tighter fit, take your time and go slow. This one is a bit snug, I will say. So you definitely wanna go slowly. And you can see what that looks like once I've gotten it into place. Now, there's no wiggle room in this. It's not going to move around on you. You can see you get a minor amount of lay on the table design with this. Screen shields will work fine. No problem here. I've got one on mine that comes in at 0.12 millimeters. Because it's a snap-on back shell, everything down below is going to be accessible to you. So no compatibility problems. Same thing with up above. Along this side, it is all enclosed. And along this side, you've got access to your buttons. You're going to feel the case a little bit when you press those buttons, uh, but it's really not that big of a deal. Along the back side, well, there it is. You've got your Solaris branding, and they've got this in different colors. I've got it in the blue here, and you can see what that's going to look like. Yes, you will run the risk of some scratching of the back of the aluminum case if you're not careful. So uh, let's get that out of the way first uh, and talk about that. So yeah, you could suffer some scratching back here, but better the case than your phone. I've got a nice accent around the camera. First off, it's lined with black, but you can see it's kind of got a precision cut here that gives a hint of silver too. So it's a very classy look and looks really, really nice. There's no issue with whiteout or washout in photos or videos when the LED flash is firing, so no problems there. And so far, I will tell you, I haven't noticed any sort of reception hit in any way, shape, or form on this. So good news there. This is the Solaris Fender. And as I say, I'll link in the description of the video as to where you can pick it up for yourself. I'm going to give this one a four and a half out of five. If you guys have questions, comments, or feedback, as always, please feel free to let me know. You can hit me up on Twitter at Metagamers, and I'll catch you next time. Take care, everybody, and have fun.